Yo, what's up, my peoples? Welcome to ADG, Rise of Sports Games Network. I'm your host, ADG, aka The Gamer. This is ADG Universe, but this is an ADG Universe special. Now, you guys may know about a little game called WWE 2K24. It comes out next week, right? So, with WWE 2K24 upon us and me just reaching Survivor Series, I gotta go into Super Sim mode. So, which is even more than a Super Sim mode than what you guys seen us doing in DWE. My, it's gonna be extra Super Sim. It's gonna be Super Sim Plus. So, I'm gonna load this up and then we're gonna talk about it. So, we're gonna set up matches and we're just gonna simulate it in this episode. Now, next episode, we're gonna be doing the normal matches. We're gonna showcase WrestleMania. I'm gonna do commentary. It's gonna be cool. But in this one, we're just going to be making history, okay? We're going to make history. We're going to, It's going to be actually definitely sim at this point. Though usually when we say super sim, we watch the matches and um, we let the CPU play things out. Today, we're just going to be like doing simulations, period, uh, without going into the matches. Now, last time around, we did the Survivor Series. Uh, Bailey did her thing. Well, actually, we didn't do Survivor Series. This is the first time with Survivor Series. Oh, okay. I I didn't do War Games. I was supposed to do War Games. What was the last thing on the calendar we did? I can't go back. I can't go back. Okay, I'll link you to the last preview in this video if you want to see how we normally get down. Uh, I'll link you to that in the first comment that's going to be pinned from yours truly, ADG Candy Gamers. So let's, uh, um, it's gonna say AG Route Sports Games Network though. But let's go ahead and get into this. So what I'm gonna do right now, I think this was going to be this matchup right here was gonna be for the title, and the game did not put it in for the title. So we're gonna set that matchup for the title. It's gonna it's, we're gonna edit this match. We're gonna put the title on the line. Okay, this match, we're going to let this happen too. This is going to be for Santos Escobar's United States Championship. Him and Santos and Austin Theory, man, their robbery has been like the entire season. If you're thinking about United States Championship and AG Universe, you have to think about those two definitely 100%. I'm going to actually edit this because Nikki and Bree are not going to be in the game. So I'm going to, I'm going to edit this out and I'm going to do something just for fun. Let's put Nikki Cross in this match. She's going to be in the next game. And I'm also going to give Nikki a, a nice new partner. Someone who's also a little over the top. Hmm. Layla's in the building. She said she wasn't going to do commentary for this, but she's watching. Do you have any ideas? And did you can jet? You got any ideas? I'm thinking Piper or Chelsea. Mm, I'm thinking more of Piper. Piper, like their old tag team? Yeah. So we're going to put Piper in this one. And we're going to put the titles on the line. Roman and Logan Paul was supposed to have a rematch. So we're going to do that one as well. Bam, bam, bam. All right. So, and then after we set up all these matches, we're just going to simulate them. We're not going to watch them like we normally do. We're just going to simulate them. I don't think none of these guys are in matches. We're going to let that stay. I don't know why Bad Bunny too much Sami Zayn, but he is. And Randy Orton and Bronson Reed, hey, and Matt Riddle, you, we, we don't even get down with you anymore. So let's go ahead and take Matt Riddle out of this thing. Matt Riddle, we don't get down with you anymore in ADG Universe. You're gone. You on another show making me mad too, by the way, Matt Riddle. Leave Tanahashi alone, bro. I feel like you ruined Tanahashi's legacy, bro. Dom is in the building too right now at the moment. You're probably thinking like, 
Why are we hating on Matt Riddle, right? No. Because no, can't. screw Matt Riddle. <laughs> he he used to be your boy. That was a long, long time ago. A long time ago. That was a long, long time ago, Jonathan. That's like how much was supposed to be a long, long time ago. <laughs> that was a long time ago. That was a long, long couple months ago, though. Long, long couple months ago. Randy really doesn't supposed to be on this particular show. So let's put Bronson Reed with someone else or something in here right now. Let's put Bronson Reed with someone else. Let's see. Omos technically is supposed to have like a... Supposed to be a free agent. Let's put Omos and Bronson Reed together. Just mad these two monsters together. Jesus Christ. That would be crazy. Then let's put MVP as their manager too. That would be crazy. Okay. They put MVP as the manager over here. I could also see them um That would be great. Let's see if these guys make something big and become a great tag team in my universe. So we're gonna keep Gunther versus Ricochet over here. We're gonna put the title on the Intercontinental Championship. It's starting to come back to me. Y'all know it's been a couple of weeks. I was setting this up, but it's been a couple of weeks. Uh, Becky Lynch and Zoe start again, but we're gonna let it happen. Give it up to Becky and Zoe. Zoe made a statement this year in my universe mode. Uh, winning the women's championship in the last pay per view against Becky. Becky won the standout stars of the season. So seeing Becky and um, Zoe go at it as much as they have, and it's been quite entertaining to say the least watching these two. So we got Seth versus Drew McIntyre. Yes, just like real life as of lately, these two have been going at it in my universe. But Drew McIntyre won the WWE World Champion Championship. Seth freaking Rollins trying to get it back. Can he get it back here tonight at Survivor Series? So we're going to keep this the way it is too. And um, let's go ahead and um, sim this thing. First matchup for the championship. Simulate it. I'm hitting the square random button, guys. And the winner is Mi Chin Mia Yim. She retained poor Bailey after cashing in the Money Bank briefcase. Did not really make the statement that she wanted to. Santos Escobar and Austin Theory, these two will not leave each other alone. The championship again here tonight. Some people probably tired this robbery, but they keep going on and on. Austin Theory takes the title from Santos Escobar. Oh my God. Oh my God. That would not have happened if probably I would have watched the match, but it is what it is. Piper and Nikki trying to take the titles from Katana Chance and Caden Carter. And the winner is... Oh, Katana Chance and Caden Carter. They defend successfully. Roman Reigns versus Logan Paul here. Roman takes the title back. No! <laughs> Roman does what he had, Roman did what he had to do. He took the title back. It is what it is. It's, it's kind of sad because we're close to the end of the season. Now the War Games match. Who wins the War Games match? Cody Rhodes, Johnny Gargano, Triple H, and Bobby Lashley defeating Shinsuke Nakamura, Finn Balor, Wade Barrett, and The Rock. That's crazy. So expect Cody Rhodes, Johnny Gargano, Triple H, and Bobby Lashley make a big statement throughout the season. Tag team action. Can these new tag teams make a statement in the tag team division? Omos and Bronson Reed get the victory here. I tell you, these are some big boys. They could go a long ways. Gunther versus Ricochet. You're calling them big, big meaty, but let's not. Big meaty? Ricochet. Okay. Ricochet with the victory. Again, over Gunther, he took the title from Gunther. It seems like Ricochet is the kryptonite for Gunther in ADG Universe. Zoe Stark looking to defend versus Becky. She took the title off her in the last pay-per-view. Can she defend it and show her dominance? She does. Zoe Stark defeats Becky Lynch. Wow, she's got something going. Seth Rollins versus Drew McIntyre. Drew also looking to defend his title. Can Seth get it back? Or will Drew prove his dominance? Drew proves his dominance. The Raw, the Raw brand had proved their dominance from Ricochet to Zoe to Drew McIntyre. They had proved their dominance. Now going into war games. Charlotte Flair, Queen Zelina, Alba Fire, and Azadon versus Rhea Ripley, Oscar, Kyra Sane, and Eos Sky. 
Damage control with Rhea Ripley did not get the job done here tonight. What? Charlotte Flair, Queen Zelina got alone. I didn't think Charlotte Flair and Queen Zelina was going to get alone after Charlotte Flair took Zelina's spot at Money in the Bank. But the team of the Unholy Union and the Questionable Union win here in War Games. What in the world just happened? So now what we're going to do, we're going to set up for the next pay-per-view. And you guys just have to trust me. We're going to do like we normally do. I'm going to set up the rivalry, and then we're just going to fast forward to the next pay-per-view. The next pay-per-view on the calendar, just so you know what we're sitting for, oh, is NXT War Games for NXT, and for the other thing is day one. Hmm. I'm going to be honest. We're going to do something a little bit more crazy. Right about now, I'm not even going to set up the rivalry. We're, we're just going to, because we got, I'm, I didn't realize I was this far behind, so we're just going to assimilate to War Games now. Simulating the war games. Not even setting up anything. Let's see who survives when I'm just simulating. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm scared to do this. Um, Technically, Albie now and Whitney Chu was supposed to be gone from this brand. So I'm going to change that match. I am going to put someone else in Ivy's place because they were supposed to be broken up after that last uh, matchup that they lost. But who can I put in here? They kind of messed up the NXT roster in WWE 2K24. Uh, uh. Yeah, like I said before, we got uh, Fallon and Roxanne. I know we got more of us. Let's put Roxanne with them. Let's see if Roxanne and Winnie Chu can get it done for the title. Indy versus Lyra Valkyria. Oh, God. My title may be vacated. I'm going to keep Indy here. I'm going to have to bring some people back to NXT anyway because the way the roster is. Commander Z's, you don't even really go here. I'm just going to delete this match. Did Tyler get announced with the new game? I can't remember. He's probably on Unlockable, probably, because he's probably a GM. Uh, I'll keep that where it is, even though Dragon Lee is not going to be in the game right away, but Tony D is a little questionable. Cameron Grimes versus Tyler Bate. I'm going to delete that one. Both of them not even on the roster anymore. Oh, man. Technically, this match, Brutus and Julius were supposed to go to another brand now. So I'm going to change this to another team for the tag team titles. I don't know what to do. Should I do Josh Brees? <laughs> well, I guess go, go ahead. What's the other guy? I didn't even know they broke up. Victor I should... Newman. I don't know. We call him Victor Newman, but I forgot. Well, his... Brooks. So guys, if you don't know, my champions will uh, roll over to the next game. Why isn't the NXT Tag Team Championship showing up right now? What? Ain't that you like that? Why is they vacated? Are those the new ones? Yeah, Lord, no. You sure? Okay, we having a little hiccup moment here. Huh. Batista versus Dijak again. Okay, let's go. Why? I don't, I'm not sure why my titles got vacated. Yeah, those are the tab titles. Oh, no, I got vacated. Okay. Going back inside the pay-per-view now. I hope you guys are enjoying this little simulation-style version of the AG Universe. And it's, co it's co-starring Princess Leia, who wasn't gonna, even going to be in here, but she is in here right now. So, I think we got all the titles on the line. Everything's good to go. We got the war game matches. And let's start simulating. I need to be back here after what happened on Ooh, I didn't mean to start the match up. I need to be back here to have an NXT with this Heritage Cup. What? NXT Heritage Cup? What NXT happened with the NXT I, Heritage Cup? Remember I told you? Oh, guys, spoilers. We're going to talk about something. Wait. Go ahead and fast forward the video uh, at least a good two to five minutes because she's going to talk about NXT. If you don't want to know about NXT Heritage Cup, go now. I'm going to give you a countdown. Five, four, three, two, one, jet. No, I'm Dollar Loon to Charlie Dempsey after 
the no call them cats cool, whatever you call them. We're in for the whole time. We may may mention, we'll do nothing wrong. Just May May Mensa doing nothing wrong. Okay, got okay, we did give up once. But he was just only one person after. Once. But no, Charlie Dempsey won. Yay. Okay guys, we are simulating now. And once again, this is not normally how we do universe mode. There are gonna be some uh there are gonna be some links in the first pin comment section as well as in the description so you guys could check out how we normally get down to age verse, which is a pure simulation, but we watch and let the CPU do the thing. Sometimes I give people pushes and I play in those matches. I don't always win in those matches, but eh, there's an eighty percent a higher chance that I'm gonna win. But Gigi Dola and JC Jane retain just like DWE. These my, my girls cannot be beat. I'm gonna have to make a cut some tops to the traction in this game because I, I doubt they're gonna have the theme in there. It'd be nice if they do though. Indy versus Lara Valkyria. I love Lara Valkyria, but right now I need her to lose. Since she ain't gonna be in the game when I get the game. Can Indy take over NXT again? No, Lara says no, this is my house. Sit down. We got war games going down, trick. We have Humberto and Angela and Joe Gacy. Interesting thing going down. But they lose to Ridge Holland, Tyler, Tyler Breeze, Dragon Lee, and Tony D'Angelo. Okay. Okay. So look for Ridge, Breeze, Lee, and D'Angelo to get a push, though. I'm probably going to push, put D'Angelo, excuse me, put uh, Tyler Breeze and Dragon Lee out of this thing for a while. Carmella Hayes versus Braun Breaker. Can Braun Breaker retain his title versus Melo? Melo says, nah, he is him, and he's back in the driving seat for NXT. And that's all it is, and that's all it's ever going to be. Carmella Hayes with the victory. Brooke Jensen and Josh Bridge taking on the Steiners. Steiner has, the Steiners have took over the NXT tag team division. Can this new team take them out? They already took out the Creed brothers. Will they take out <laughs> Briggs and Jensen? Oh, they do. <laughs> they lose. I just knew Brooks and <laughs> Jensen wasn't ready for the Steiners. Batista said he wanted to win the titles. He wanted to win the titles here at NXT and make a new name for himself to prove that he still got it. He's taking on my force of Dodge I am torn in this, but who will win the North American Championship? Dodge retains against Batista. But Batista just can't get it done. And now it's War Games with Tiffy, Cora Jade, Miko Satamore, and B Fab get the victory over Nikita Lyons, Blair Davenport, Thea Hale, and Lash Legend. Can they these teams get along? Because I can tell that some of these people don't even belong on the team together. Oh, give it up for B Fab, Miko Satamore, Cora Jade, and Tiffany Stratton for the victory. And say goodbye to Tiffany Stratton because she'll be headed to SmackDown. Don't wonder if I should do it because the way the new game is. Mmm. -hmm. All right, so we're going to be super simming once again. This time around, we're simming to day one. I do apologize that we, we're not doing this today the way you guys really expect me to do it, but at least you guys are going to see a, a preview of teams that are getting it done and people that are getting it done in... Um, my universe mode so let's edit these see what needs to be edited mm, they want dakota and eo sky this is questionable i'm gonna change this out um i'm gonna put oh i can't put Kyrie in here either oh god i can only put oscar in this spot yes we have damage control bowls too No managers, no managers. Just the championship being on the line. Yeah, I still want to keep this like realistic to like real life as much as possible. Though sometimes, you know, things be oh solo getting a shot at the United States Championship. Chelsea versus Charlotte Flair, they've been going at it for a while. Cameron Grimes and Santos Escobar robbery. Just been happening for a while too. They got a lot of robberies going on on this show. Ugh, why, why, why are we doing this? 
Why, why are we why are we doing this okay i'm gonna delete this last match and put it with a women's matchup put a women title on raw so let's look at the championship rankings actually i'm just gonna do power rankings i'm gonna do power rankings it would be becky again that's what it would be. It would be Becky again. Becky versus Zoe again. But let's put some stank on it. Like what? Put some stank on it? Yes, we're gonna put some we're gonna put some stank on this match. It's gonna be uh Steel Cage. Simulate. Let's go. Let's go. And I'm gonna be honest. This is taking even longer than what I expected. But it. But this. Oh, I start this match up. Someone on crap on me. Let's talk a little bit. We, we'll talk a little WWE again. So did Carl? I didn't watch the show tonight because I was sick, and I, I slept through the show. Um. So Carl and Luke did they show up again on NXT? Yeah, it'd be the Eldritch and Malik. Eldritch and Malik? Yeah. You, you think they're trying to do something, a big title match at NXT Stand and Deliver, maybe? Uh, it's at the grand match. Say she came out. So did Flajor and Axiom. And... The LWO for some reason? The LWO? Yeah. They just putting everybody in this match. It's like, yo. Oh, God. I did it again. I do apologize, guys, but I don't have time to edit this video today. I really don't. <laughs> Dude, that's why, I'm, that's why I said this video is longer than what I expected it to be. But hopefully you guys are still loving the simulations. I've seen, I've seen other people do this a lot. Videos like this a lot. Where they just see it, and that's where I got the idea from. People that play Universe Mode and they just like, I did three years in Universe Mode. You seen those before? Like, yeah. I, I did three years in Universe Mode. This is what my WrestleMania turned out to be. So like, <laughs> anyway, you can tell I'm not used to simulating because I press X every time. Otis, Chad Gable, Bert, well, the Apple Academy versus Carl Anderson, Luke Gallows, tag titles on the line. These two have been going at it for months. But tonight, Chad Gable and Otis get it done. Alpha Academy, your new, your new Adiverse Undisputed World Tag Team Champions. Damage Control versus Katana Chance and Caden Carter. And your winners are... Damage Control, EO Sky, and Asuka getting it done here tonight. Solo Sokoa looking to take the title from Austin Theory, who just won it from Santos Escobar. Trying to put some gold in the bloodline. So it's the with the victory. Take that theory. And now Shotzi versus Charlotte Flair. Flair. These two don't like each other. They're just trying to gun to the top of the divisions. Oh, Charlotte Flair with the victory. Then we got Cameron Grimes versus Santos Escobar. Also, me, me and Ian might want to be on the lookout for Charlotte Flair. She might be gunning for the title. Santos might be trying to come back and get that United States Championship as well as Cameron Grimes. Santos wins tonight after losing at the last pay-per-view. Jimmy Uso versus Omos. These two just don't like each other. It started with MVP. Defeated Roman Reigns. Omos won't have to tag. To, well, he's not going to have to tag to Chevy. He won a big match with uh, Bronson a couple days ago. And um, bam. But tonight, Jimmy Uso gets it done again. Jimmy Uso is the force to be reckoned with in my season. I'm surprised he's not became a champion. Bad News Barrett versus Gunther. Maybe these two want a shot at the Intercontinental Championship held by Ricochet in the upcoming event. Here at day one, Gunther gets the victory. Zoe Stark versus Becky Lynch. They're at it again, but this time in a steel cage. And the winner is... Becky Lynch wins back the title here tonight. <laughs> Zoe Stark loses the title. Becky Lynch is once again the champion. What do you have to say about Becky being the champion? Boo, Becky, boo. Uh, boo, Becky, boo. I actually like Becky. They're like we should have taken a but we're not going to talk about that. 
All right, we're simming again on the counter now. We're on the road now to NXT New Year's Evil. Who will make their mark in Ages Universe? Like I said, this is our special simulation episode, but we'll be back to normal in the next episode. And I may say this 15, 20 times during this because I know people fast forward through the videos. So yeah. Oh no, this is kind of off me and, and Layla right now because in DWE, these two have been friends, though a lot they may be uh, not friends. Also in DWE soon. Uh, well, I gotta, I gotta, I gotta take the time to take Ivy off the show. They keep putting her in matches. Ivy, get out of here. Goodbye, Ivy. But give it up to that. That was one of my best custom teams, Sleepy Mind. That's why I gave her like a custom attire. Uh, Wendy Chu, it was really nice. It's one of my most watched Twitch uh, clips. So, yeah. So now I got to replace. Wendy Chu keeps stalking. Alone. She's like, I gotta do it. I gotta do it with somebody. Nikita Lyons, maybe? Because I don't think I got Nikita doing anything. When did you and Nikita Lyons? Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Tyler Bay, I don't know if you should be in this match, bro. I need to take you off this show, too. Let's put somebody else in Tyler Breeze's place. I do Wesley because Wesley was getting it done in our uni my universe and he never got really a shot at anything else. Let's do Wesley. Oh man, they put the Creed brothers back in this. Uh, Creed, y'all supposed to be gone too. Get, get out of here. Get get the step it then I have Tony I got Tony D in stacks so I'm gonna put Tony D in there man. let's see if they can get it done all right so we got Tony D in stacks Scott Steiner and Rick Steiner Gonna probably delete this main event out because yeah, that's just it's just not even important. And that's simulate our New Year's Eve. <laughs> Tiffany and Roxanne Perez. We said Tiffany was gone, but Tiffany came back just to get a victory over Roxanne Perez. Poor Roxanne. Ridge and Dijak teaming up tonight for some weird reason. Versus Trick and Noam Dar. This is interesting. Uh, I should have deleted that one or edited it. The winners are Ridge Holland and Dijak over Noam Dar and Trick Williams. The North American champion is whooping up on people for the heck of it. Nikita Lyons and Wendy Chu trying to get the tag team titles from Gigi Dolan and JCJ. Can they do it? I love you, JC! And... <gasps> It happened. It happened. It happened. Guys, you, I have been saying, and the rules are in both of my universe modes, if a team breaks up in real life, they don't immediately break up right away in my universe. They got to lose the titles if they're champions first before I break them up. So now I have to break up Gigi Dawn, JCJ, and going into... Of WWE 2K24. It is what it is. I don't know what's going to happen to the tag team divisions because y'all know in real life now they're not really doing tag team divisions in um, NXT. Yeah, which they've got the women tagging together. Yeah, even though they got a bunch of tag teams and people are grouping up together, they're not doing it. But congratulations to Nikita Lyons and Winnie Chu becoming champions here in 80s Universe. Now the NXT tag, an uh, NXT title, Wesley, Braun Breck, and Carmella Hayes. And the winner is. 
Wesley. I put Wesley in here and he finally did it. It's been Braun Breaker and Carmelo Hayes all season long when it comes to the NXT title. So congratulations to Wesley giving some new some new flavor to the NXT brand. Stax and D'Angelo, can they do the same thing for the tag team division? Will we have new flavor? Will Scott Stein and Rick Steiner finally retire? And no, the Steiners do it again in the main event. They cannot be beat. These teams aren't ready for Scott Steiner and Rick Steiner. Next show. How many shows do we got to go? I may just skip over some shows with their small time shows at this point. We got Royal Rumble, Elimination Chamber, and Standing Limit. I guess it's just going to be a long special. It's going to probably be another 30 minutes on this. So it's going to still end up being an hour video. <laughs> Let's get to the Royal Rumble. It was like, oh no, we're simulating the Royal Rumble and not watching it? Yes. That's going to be crazy, but that's exactly what we're doing. All right, let's mark it and let it be known who our winners are tonight for the Royal Rumble. What? I, I got to do some more things. I got to take Nikki and them out. Nikki. Are you sure you don't want to look who's in the Royal Rumble, Mac? You don't want my dad showing up or something. Uh, it, it, it probably won't. They probably won't. They, it, it, they, they know, uh, the game knows who's on your roster. It, it just, to be honest, normally it puts the people in the top power rankings get in the room, which is good. A lot of people don't know that, but yeah, that's what happened. That's why I'm taking bringing them out now because I don't want them showing up in the, um, done it. I might need to look just because of them. Because they probably already set them in the in the um, match. Because they're they've been in the top of the rankings. I'm I'm gonna I got I gotta say I'm gonna miss bringing Nikki in the game. Like oh god, I gotta take Brock Lesnar. Some people are like oh no, don't take Brock Lesnar out. He's innocent and too proven guilty. You know that man did. That's not how real life works sometimes. While it's true, he's not really completely guilty, but until he proves himself not guilty, you gotta you, you gotta put him to the side. If he's not guilty, one day I will apologize for everything. But at the moment, bruh. I'm gonna just some of these oh they got oh man, I just realized. It looked like they still got, uh, I still got, I still got Bray on the show. R.I.P. Bray. So I'm just going to delete that one. Why are they doing it? Just delete that one. Logan doesn't have the title anymore, right? No. So, so I'm deleting that one. Deleting that one. I'm just deleting matches. Why did they have Otis and Beer? <laughs> what? What what are y'all doing here? That'll be more like it. Rematch for the titles. What, what are y'all doing? Oh no. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Okay, this is what we're gonna do now. I'm gonna go I, no. No. Nope, don't do this. That's not happening. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna look at the rankings on Raw and then I'm gonna sign a, a, a good contender. Are, are we serious right now? See that? You know what? Nope. I ain't doing this. Actually I'm, I'm gonna since we're in, I'm gonna look at the power rankings actually. Gunther doesn't have a title, does he? But he's... That, that, even though Gunther didn't win it, that's what Gunther in the match versus Drew for the title. That could be different for my show. So let's... Let's give Gunther the, the shot instead. I know I'm not looking at the division rankings, when normally that's what I look at, but since I'm in kind of a rush, I'm just doing it with the power ranking.
And I, I'm like you, Layla. I might need to look at the. I might need to look at the participants. You don't want egg well shot. Oh, see, yeah, I might need to look at the, like I said, need to look at the participants. You don't want egg well shot on the Royal Rumble. I want Booker T in it, man. Edge, Grayson Waller, they gotta take Edge out. That's what Bad Bunny in it. Shanky, you gotta go too, sorry. See, yeah, good thing I did look. This will be a chance for Batista to come back to the main roster. Bobby, Big E, Elton Prince. What was Elton Prince one? Top Dollar, you gotta go. Goodbye, Top Dollar. Cedric, this could be a big break, bro. Don't mess it up. Goodbye, Elias. Hello, Dominic Mysterio. Some of these, I feel like. Goodbye, Rick Booz. Hello, Finn Balor. I'll keep Uncle Howdy in. So these tag team, they put a lot of tag team people in this. Uh, goodbye, Humberto and Angel. Hello, Hollywood Hogan. Hello, Jay. I'll put you in. I talk about tag team people, but he's not really tag team lately. Hello, Johnny. Goodbye, Happy Corbin. Hello, Ray. I want to do something with Ray in my universe, bros. It just hasn't happened yet. Goodbye, Cruz Del Toro. Hello, Rob Van Dam. Goodbye, Walking Wow. Hello, Shawn Michaels. You're like, why you keep trying to play? We did the same thing in our universe, didn't we? Goodbye, Angelo Dawkins. Okay. Goodbye, Angelo Dawkins. Hello, Shinsuke Enoch. Come back. I'm gonna let Pretty Deadly stay. All right, let's go. I do gotta change the women matchup. Once again, guys, this is not the normal 80 universe. This is a Super Sim Plus special where we're simming all the way to WrestleMania. But the next time you see us, it'll be the normal way you get to see all the matches, all the pageantry, all the glory of WrestleMania. We're just in a grind right now because. 2K24 comes out next week, and I need to finish my season. I want to make those moments that we talk, that we have in Age Universe some way, some fashion, and make some type of history. Oh, Leah, you gotta go. Blair, you can come in. Lacey, you gotta go too. Chelsea, you can come in. Kyrie, you gotta go. Sadly, Charlotte, you can come in. I have two Oslo's and I gotta make sure it's the right one. This one's mine. Shot C, stay in. Scarlet, you can stay in. Zelina, Bianca, Tiffany, Sonya, JC, Jane. You're like, what, Dad? You put it in? No, no, I didn't put it in. I didn't put it in, but she's staying there. Danny Lonely, you gotta go. I'm sorry, I love you, but. Ivy, you can take her place. Rhonda, you can stay in. Should I keep Stephanie in? I think she's not in the game, so... I like Stephanie. I, I hate that she's been through all the things she's been through. Do drop. Take you out. I'll put... Put someone else in. Let's put Liv in. You know, I don't really like her. I'm not sure. I'll let Gigi stay in here, too. Miko, you gotta go, too. Um, Rhea comes in. Rihanna, you gotta go. By the way, guys, make sure you catch my Rihanna, my Rod series, which is gonna still be going on off and on during the course of the 2K24 season. And period, I am gonna finish it one way or another. Not only that, my Rod, any careers or anything here on AG Rod Sports Games Network, we're gonna try to get those things done. We're gonna try to make it happen uh, eventually. And you guys see my controller went dead for a second, so I had to plug it in. Plug it in, plug it in. Should I put uh, Shane in? Yeah. Shane, okay. Nikki ASH, you gotta go. I put Raquel in. We got Piper over here. Mercedes Monet, oh. 
Sorry, Mercedes. Roxanne, I'll put you in. China definitely has to go as well. RIP China. Trish Stratus, I'll put her in. I think we got that amount of star power, indie stuff in here. Some fantasy stuff as well. And I think I'm going to take B Fab out because I'm not sure she her position in a new game. I think they had a full advantage. Yeah, that's, that's all I was thinking. And I'm. Ooh, Lita? Yeah, I'm going to put Lita in. All right, let's get to the Simmons. Women's Royal Rumble. Who's going to go on to WrestleMania? And the winner of the match is the 80 vs. 23 Royal Rumble. Did, did, did they even say? Why does it tell me? It doesn't tell me. Okay. Maybe I need to. Maybe if I go out. Okay, let me um first simulate this one. Tag team match: Carl Anderson, Luke Gallows versus the champs, Chad Gable and um, Otis Alpha Academy. Winners are Alpha, Alpha Academy. They keep their titles. I'm gonna look at the news page because it does it. It didn't show up on the thing. Wait a minute. Where's my news page? News page. Oh. I think they moved it. Okay, Bianca Belair Yay! won it. Y'all need to fix that. I, I never, I, I didn't know that it wouldn't do that. In this year's game, make sure y'all don't do that next year. In 2K24, it needs to show up. The Royal Rumble has been won by Bianca Belair, given the Superstar Championship match in the main event of WrestleMania. So we could see Bianca and Zoe, or Bianca and Becky, or we could see. Bianca and me, Chim, me, and Yim, or whoever has the title. They haven't put me, Chim, in any matches, so we'll see. All right, Solo and Austin Theory. Austin Theory. Wait a minute, I thought, I thought Austin Theory lost the title. What is this? Didn't he lose it? I thought he did. I thought he lost it, too. Did he gain it back or something? Usually, if they're on that side, that means... Oh, well, Solo's the champion right now. We know for sure. Seth freaking Rollins versus Sami Zayn. These guys just gunning for the top of the roster here. Seth wins the match. Gunther versus Drew McIntyre for the WWE World Heavyweight Championship. It's funny because these two early in the season, they were teaming up against Ricochet. Oh, no, against Apollo Crews. But Drew... Wins and poor Gunther just can't get it done. Now, this matchup. Who's the winner of the 30 men's Royal Rumble? We know it's not going to show up for some weird reason. We're going to have to look at the actual news. So, we will tell you that now by looking at the calendar. Bobby Lashley. Bobby Lashley will be going to WrestleMania to headline the WrestleMania main event. So that's going to be interesting. So remember the actual WrestleMania event I will be doing. Um, yeah, the actual... I'm sorry, I got distracted there. The actual WrestleMania event we will be doing. So here in this video, we're going to be doing Elimination Chamber and Stand and Deliver. So yes, I'm not gonna be actually showcasing Stand and Deliver. Some people may hate me for that. Oh, how could you? Just don't have the time. Just don't have the time. I may delete half of the matches out the Elimination Chamber that they give us and just mainly do the Elimination Chamber matches. So, let's see. I don't think the game actually puts 
Why are they doing some of these matches? I don't. I do not know. I don't know. <laughs> I was like, I do not know why some of these matches are taking place. Yeah, they, that's a play on that. That's right there. They're defending the title in the Elimination Chamber. That's what they're doing. Like how it used to be. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep it that way. All right, I'm deleting this robbery match. I'm deleting that robbery match. I'm deleting that robbery match. I'm deleting that one. <laughs> I'm deleting that one. <laughs> deleting that one. <laughs> we just deleting everything. <laughs> deleting that one. And the funny thing about that Robin Ann and Bad Bunny thing, that comes back to the very first of the season and they're meeting up again, but we're deleting it. Uh, AJ and Big E, I don't even know why this is happening. We're going to delete that. Oh, we're only doing a Elimination Chamber match in the Elimination Chamber. Let's go. <laughs> Super Sim Plus. <laughs> So who wins this match? Who's going on to WrestleMania as the champion? Seth freaking Rawls. Uh, he, he wins back his title in the chamber. Oh, man. I know Joe mad about this. Damon and Finn, why didn't y'all work together? <laughs> so here we go. We got, oh, man. Carmella should have been in this because Carmella was been a mainstay, but I guess she fell off when I was simming. And here we go. Who's going to go on to WrestleMania as the champion? Last call for alcohol. Raquel Rodriguez. Raquel is the women's world champion. Defeating Zoe, Becky, Shayna Baszler, Alexa Bliss, and Rhea Ripley. Why didn't y'all jump her? Why didn't y'all jump her? She's the biggest one in the At least he wasn't Liv Morgan. Let's move on. <laughs> we got Liv Morgan's biggest fan just stepped in the room. You got something to say, bro? You got something to say? Yeah, yeah, I'm dissing her again. Donna, get over Roy, the no. Royal Rumble, bro. I, I, I no, uh, the reason why I do this, guys, is because I've been mad because even though I knew Sasha probably wasn't going to return, I, I, I get mad. I got mad because... Just seeing Liv come out in that spot that I wanted to be Sasha's, and I'm just like, okay, whatever. F Liv Morgan. <laughs> I wasn't mad. About Liv that. Morgan fans get upset with me. I know. I wasn't mad with one more. I'm mad at the elimination. What she thought? What she thought she ate when she eliminated Tiffany and Bianca? I don't know. I don't know. Once again, just a couple of information in case you know. Do not confuse ADG Universe. Because I, I know the AG fam in the building with me right now. Do not confuse this with DWE. That's a totally different thing, which we'll be finishing up that as well in the, in the next couple of days. We were supposed to do Stand and Deliver tonight, but we didn't. Uh, it's going to be coming up. We'll probably do two shows in a row in the next couple of days, live here and on Twitch. So simultaneous at the same time. So here comes my Stand and Deliver here. Is all the titles on the line. That's the only thing that matters to me. Why they put Tyler Breeze in the match? You see, now I gotta change that. Why are y'all doing this, man? To be honest, I think it should be Braun, Carmelo, and uh, Wesley. That's what I think it should be from what I've been looking at. Um, Just to be honest, and that's what I'm gonna do. I'm sorry, Tyler, you gotta go. I'm gonna delete. <laughs> Drew versus Dijak, I think that should happen. What? Didn't I take Abby off the show? Abby! I think because they're still in the tag team together. That's the problem. And and Gigi and JC lost the titles. It's over. It's over. I hate that I had to get... Oh, God. What to do about this? I think I'm going to give Tiffany this one more shot. And then... if Later on, bring her over to SmackDown. Batista, just have a moment, I guess. I, I No, that, that's not even important. Both of you guys, no, I'm sorry. Y'all been cut. <laughs> uh, uh, that's got to change, too. Okay, this is what I'm do. Let's customize this match. It's going to be a triple threat TLC match. No, let's make it extreme rules. And we're going to put, of course, Braun and Carmella in this. They deserve this last chance to uh, make a statement and going into 2K24 as champions, though. So remember, these champions that this standing deliver will go over 
to the next show. So, Carmelo, you got one more chance, but you got one more chance. And the reason why I changed the other one because I'm gonna change this one to something a little bit more extravagant. And this baby Batista's way of getting the titles. You're gonna you're gonna see what I'm gonna do right here. Let's customize this match. We're gonna have eight teams. Yes, I'm I'm probably doing what they're about to do in real life. It's gonna be a ladder four way tag. So I'm going to say this might not be fair. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this? Because uh, in a way, I'm trying to put titles on some people and trying to take titles off some people. This is just what you got to do. Sean's like, I'm supposed to be in the back. I don't supposed to be trying to win the tag team title. He's like, come on, Sean. One more match, Sean. One more match. Team with me. You stand and deliver, man. Let's do it. You are NXT, Sean. You are NXT. And just like real life, Carl Anderson and him are coming back to NXT <laughs> for this match. And last but not least, the LWO. Not, no, 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 not you. <laughs> what? The, no, not, not you, not you. Not, not you, you don't supposed to be a part of this. I thought I took you out of the group. He said, mm, not you, boy, not you, mm, mm Not you, not you, that's not, that's not happening. And I think everything else stays the same, but we are gonna change this match down here. I don't understand, though. Why didn't they put the title on the line? Don't. Don't. Didn't Wendy and them beat? It was Wendy and who? Who beat them? Wendy and Nikita. So Wendy and Nikita should be defending the titles, but they did that instead. They gotta work on that AI. <laughs> For match, their matchmaking AI. Hmm. You think about that, it's it. JC and Thea? <laughs> yeah, I like that better. I like it. JC and Thea going for the tag titles. I think that makes a good, uh, I think this makes a good uh, stand and deliver, personally. All right, let's do it, guys. I mean, did I have the North American Championship on the line? Yeah, Dodgex defending against Drew, right? Yeah. All right, this is gonna be our last uh, sim, and then we're gonna talk a little bit about WrestleMania, and we'll be caught up. And remember, the next show is gonna be an actual show. We're gonna be watching the matches and everything. I'll be calling the action, the play-by-play -play by yours truly, and um, it'll be a nice t time. And also, DW tomorrow is will be starting back tomorrow as well. We have Stand and Deliver and WrestleMania coming up. So this weekend, the, the last two shows of DWE, our family universe, and Adiverse, the way you guys normally see it from me, though, who knows? Layla might show up in there as well. She might. She might. No guarantees on that. Let's go ahead and start this. Actually, simulate. I'm about to start the match, and you know what that'll do. The and JC Jane versus Nikita Lyons and Wendy Chu. Thea and JC did it here at NXT Stand and Deliver. They are new tag team champions. I love you, JC. Let's go. Drew Gulak and Dijak. I'm a little conflicted here. I'm a no quarter catch uh, fan. Yes. Uh, and Dijak wins. And I'm not I'm not hating. I love Dijak. I've been dying for him to be a champion. So Dijak, you guys are looking at champions that will start my NXT universe. Thea Hell and JC Jane will be our NXT champions going into WWE 2K24. Dijak, 
will be the North American champion going into WWE 2K24. But who will be the NXT Women's Champion going into WWE 2K24? If Lyra wins this, we're going to have to vacate the title. Tiffany does it. <gasps> Tiffany will be going into NXT as the champion in WWE 2K24. Even though she's still technically on SmackDown. But for a while, we're going to have to do this this way. And I'm so glad. I mean, Dragon Lee did it when you're no man champion. Why can't, why can't you do 2K24 it? 2K24 and NXT is Tiffy time. Now, we might have some interesting tag team titles champions here. Ladder 40 tag, some big names in this. They still won it! Oh my God! <laughs> oh my God, the Steiners cannot be stopped. The Steiners, Rick Steiner and Scott Steiner will still be the NXT tag team champions. They are officially the best NXT ADG Universe Tag Champions of all time. Give it up to the Steiners. They have proved above and beyond that they still got it. B defeating Batista and Shawn Michaels, the DX Evolution Connection, the OC, and the LWO in a ladder four-way tag. Dang. <laughs> Just, Jesus, get off the Steiners, notorious. Can Braun Breaker do the same here tonight? And will his family be celebrating again here at Stand and Deliver, taking over NXT? Or will Carmelo prove that he is him once again on Wesley show that he is the future? Wesley proving that he is the future! Winning the Extreme Rules match, so that means Wesley will be the champion for ADG Universe and NXT for the WWE 2K24 season. I can't wait to do that. That we'll probably see that show pop off the first day of release. And I'll be playing early, courtesy of the 40 years of WrestleMania Attention. Yes. Also guys, there should be a video coming up soon of me pre-ordering the and just having a good old time uh, pre-ordering and setting up the pre-order stuff. Um, it's gonna be nice, it's gonna be nice. I'm gonna just, we're gonna be reacting. We're gonna be, it's gonna be fun. Should be a little bit after this. All right, so guys, now we're gonna simulate two WrestleMania. We're not gonna play in WrestleMania. We're just gonna talk about some of the things that may happen since this video has already went over almost an hour. I might as well go ahead and um, tell you what's gonna happen. Simulating the WrestleMania. And right there, I can already tell. It looked like, it looked like Bobby's going after Roman. That's a good bill. Bianca decided to go after Mi Chin, which makes sense because she's on the SmackDown brand. For some reason, and I think that would be a for some reason, Bad Bunny and uh, Robin then want to get extreme. If I had room on the match, they on the match card, I may let them go at it. Let them get extreme. That'd be a good little fantasy WrestleMania match. I mean, we are we are in Hollywood, right? Is that the Hollywood or the Dallas one? I think the Dallas. In this house, yeah. They want to start off with Bianca and Michi and me and you. We're going to edit that, of course. And that's going to be... That's going to be Asuka and EO because they got the titles, I believe. Yeah. So that's going to be Asuka and EO. That's probably definitely going to be edited. I don't know why they're doing an eight-man tag. That's going to be edited. Uh, Let me look at my championships real quick. Because th this right here is all over the place right now. So we're going to definitely see... We're going to see Solo defend. Austin uh, is probably not going to be in a match. We're going to see Seth defend. We're going to see Raquel defend. Um, I want to announce the Raquel match. By actually looking at the division. So what I'm going to do is actually look at the division right now and set up the Raquel match. So what you're going to see at WrestleMania, our actual WrestleMania show. Oh, I think this is a good match, though. What do you think? Zoe versus Raquel? Yeah, that sounds pretty good to me. We're going to do Zoe versus Raquel. And that that's going to be a, a WrestleMania match for them. It's going to make my thing stand out. I'm not sure why they didn't put it. They got all these matches on the card. But they didn't make Raquel a match. What what are they doing? So I'm gonna edit this one and go ahead and make this match for Raquel and Zoe. I mean Zoe had a good season. 
I mean, I think she deserves this WrestleMania moment to go one on one with the and have a good shot. Because I don't think they 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 even put her in that match. I don't think they even put her in that Elimination Chamber match, and she should have been in it to be honest. So we're gonna definitely see Zoe and Raquel. I don't know why they want to do this match. That's gonna probably be deleted. They want to do MVP and Logan. It does make sense in a way. MVP and Logan have been getting in each other's way of being the champions. So them doing this now could be big. And who knows? Maybe I'll name them the number one contender if they win this match. Going into 2K24 season. Omos and Solo Sokoa. This makes a lot of sense. This makes, Let me explain why this makes sense. And I'm going to keep that that way. Omos has been... A thorn in the side. Omos and MVP. We need to put MVP in the corner of Omos, though. This makes a lot of sense. Omos and MVP have been really, like, doing things against the, the bloodline. MVP even beating... MVP even beating uh, Roman Reigns at one point. Jimmy Uso and Omos have been going at it. So... This right here makes a lot of sense. This makes sense. They Give it up to the 2K AI for this one. That one makes sense. Now, I don't know why we going Otis and Veer Mahan with this. I don't know why. They, did Veer Mahan join the Apple Academy? Because it seems like they did. They keep trying to put... The, they keep... We're going to change that as well. It's going to be... The, we may do Apple Academy and Luke Giles again, but we're going to do something big like a Hell in a Cell or something. I mean, it's, it's WrestleMania, okay? Uh... Johnny versus Ricochet, I agree with that one. We're going to keep that one. Johnny has been trying to win gold this entire season. so, And I tried to do it myself at one time. I think I lost the match. Or I put him in a match previously, and he lost it. Sammy and CM Punk. Mm. That one's getting deleted. They keep wanting to do this one. That's, that one's going to stay. Cody versus Seth freaking Rollins. I think that that needs to stay. What do you think? I think so too. Maybe Cody can find Finch his story. Yeah, uh, Bobby versus Roman Reigns. Yeah, yeah. So this is gonna be an actual show like we normally do. I don't know why they in, why they've been trying to do this match. Maurice and Becky versus Ronda and Steph with Triple H in the corner. I, in a way, I get it. Ronda, Becky, and, and them. It's like they know they all friends. Mm. But this Becky and Maurice thing over here, I, I I don't understand that. I guess it's the battle of the TV shows, you know. But remember, Becky never had been on a show, though. So I don't know what that's about. We're going to delete that one. We're going to probably put something else in its place. Or that would be the main event, and I just delete this. Well, you'll figure it out when I start the next show. I just want to give you guys a idea of what you're going to see at WrestleMania. Both of the women matches are... are have the, both of the women matches been set yet? No, they didn't set the... Yeah, they did set the both of the women match have been set. The United States Championship match has been set. Intercontinental has been set. Both of the top championships have been set. So who knows? That may get deleted. That one may get deleted. We're going to have some fun, though. We're going to have to save this stuff the way it is now. An actual straight-up show is coming next with WrestleMania for Age of Universe. We are going to end the normal way. Actual matches. Me calling the commentary. It's going down in the next episode. If I had to say one of the matches I'm looking for right now, Bobby and Roman out of the men's division. Seth and Cody, definitely out of the men's division. Bianca and Mickey and Yim, I just want to see this. So technically, this is a perfect match for Black History Month because Mickey Yim is a little black. She's black and Eve, Philippine and all types of stuff. She She's mixed with a lot. Oh, Uncle Al trying to be in her, her corner? What? Hey, AJ. <laughs> Okay, Alan. Maybe we need to get Montez in the corner of Bianca. Maybe. And then later on, maybe you can do a match between Bianca and AJ on the show just for the heck of it. See what they, see, just, just see what they can do. They can make a WrestleMania moment, make a statement before going in 2K24. Maybe I'll push them a little bit more going in 2K24. Give them a guaranteed match at the SmackDown premiere of WWE 2K24 for AD Universe. Maybe that's what I'll do. Also, I want to know in the comments, do you guys think I should start simming more in Universe? Like, do like two weeks and then sim? What do you guys think? Because I, I think that might be the best for me to do with my personal universe. Because I do so much stuff, and it may be what I need to do.
you guys let me know in the comments what you think uh this is about having fun see who's gonna be on top some people don't think universe mode is that hype anyway or you know that hot you know, but I, I really love it roman over there just waiting to take on bobby lashley you guys thank you guys for watching this special super sim that took over an hour to, for us to get to wrestlemania but we got the wrestlemania we caught up and we'll be finishing the wwe 2k23 season of age universe very soon Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys for WrestleMania. Yeah, I'll see you guys next show, next WrestleMania show. I'm out of here. Peace.